Welcome back to another episode of MLB's Road to the Show. Welcome back to episode 13. Let's get right into the next set of games. <clears throat> if you guys remember, we took the last... Uh, took the Yankees, I believe, two games to three. Under the lights this evening. There's a couple of YouTubers that I want to uh, give a shout out to that actually have encouraged me to keep these these going. Um, they're also uh, MLB the show content creators, and that's uh, TD Barrett, and the other one is Benny No. Um, I love watching their videos. I love watching what they do. It's just fun watching their vids. Uh, so we're stepping into the top of the first. One out, one on. Uh, Tanner Rourke is on the mound. He's rocking a two-seam, four-seam, slider, curve, and a changeup. Has a look. Now the pitch. Hit high and deep out there to left center field. And it died on the tracks. So we're down. So we're up one nothing, and we're out at the plate. So top of the fourth, we're down one run. One out, nobody on. First pitch on its way. There's a swing and he sends a ball high in the air into left field. McKinney is back to the warning track. That looked like the ball went out. Ready for another shot now. Here we go, top of the seventh inning. Two two, no one, no out. But this one's been flying by. Yeah, I'll agree with that, If we can't get a hit this game, our hitting streak comes to an end. Nibbling around the strike zone at all. And they've trusted their defense to make the plays, and they've done just that. Yeah, and it's resulted in a game that could really go either. Oh, oh this kicks right off of them. Well, it took him till the seventh, but he gets his first hit of the game here, and that'll extend his hitting. Streak. Okay, cool. So yeah, he didn't come out of his. He didn't come out. He count that as a hit. All day, Dan <laughs> kept the front shoulder tough, kept the ice water in his veins, and didn't try and get too big. Extends the hitting streak. Nice job. You know, D. Rowe, I talked to him before the game about the streak, and he said the toughest part is he hopes to get hits early in the game to take the pressure off. He had to wait to the seventh inning in this one to come through. And the throw will be too late as he can't recover in time. Coming to the plate now, Dominic Smith. 0 for 2 from him so far in this one. And late reactions, and they got him. Damn it. So we're coming in top of the ninth, down one run. He's one for two in the ball game. Nobody on, nobody out. We're gonna try going for a home run here. So Juan Nicasio is on the mound. He's got a slider, four seam, and a two seam fastball. First pitch of the at bat on its way. A swing and a shot hit down the corner. Oh, and a big sigh of relief on the mound is that nearly dang tied, man, dang, dang, foul. dang it. Hard hit ball towards the hole, yeah, and that'll be a base hit. So they couldn't ask for more as the possible tying runs aboard to kick off the night. I wanted that home run. I really and did for anything more than getting a lead off man mm. on right there it brings the go-ahead run to the plate he's in position to do some damage it'd be interesting to see how the manager plays this the, well. he, what I find funny is that the manager tells me to steal and then when I steal and I get picked off and again, a throw. they and ring me out for safely. it and tell me we don't need it then stop telling me to freaking steal Hernandez gets his lead at first, nobody out. 
Runners going. Strike taken. The throw is not close as he's in there with a So now we now we uh multiple times thinking now we kill the chance of a double play. They were onto him, but he just waited it out and took off when he had the chance. Nice job of base running. Oh no no no. And the runner stuck in a pickle between third base. That's not what I wanted. I don't know why he didn't steal why he didn't slide. It's a costly double play. Three to two, the finish in tonight's game. Uh, that's not what I wanted to do. First for the victorious Blue Jays, three runs, five hits, no errors. They left. We are under the light. So coming to the plate, top Jackson of the first, Fernandez. two out, he drove in the nobody on. Last night. We are going to face Sean Reed Foley. He's rocking a four seam slider curve change up and a two seam fastball. First pitch coming, here it is. Wow. Popped him up. That Makes ball came in slowly. real fast. And the inning is over. So we step in top of the third one on two out we're up one run almost went deep his last AB certainly just missed it with this guy's big power he's feeling pretty good at the dish look for him to try and get on something and drive it out of the yard this AB it's a high fly ball headed for the left field corner if it stays fair it's gone but it bends just foul into the second deck there we go, baby. Boom! Home run. Top of the fifth. One on, no out. We're up five runs. Jacob Wagu Spock. I don't know how you pronounce that. First pitch of the at bat on its way. Line drive to left. Hey, nice drive. Coming on is Brantley, but he won't get there. It's a base hit. So a solid single to left, and that gives him a multi-hit game here tonight. And we take a look there at the team leaderboard in that category as his total is currently tops on the Tiger squad. So a runner at first. He's really having a big gone. pimple on my nose. Bring up the left-handed bat of Dominic Smith. Oh, and they pulled a string on a good Come on, Smith, there. man. You need to start hitting the ball. Strikes for the second time tonight. <clears throat> Digging in, Austin hmm. Allen. Two hits in two trips for him thus far. The one-one home, and there he goes towards second. Skied in the air to straightaway left. And he'll get there in plenty of time to put this one away, and that ends the inning. One left for Detroit. Top of the seventh, one on, one out, JC up five runs. Singled his last time up. <clears throat> Ready to deliver. Here's the and deep to left. This one's got plenty of distance. And Top of the ninth, no on, no out, three for four, up eight runs. Anthony Bass is now on the mound. He has a slider, four seam fastball, cutter, change up in a two seam fastball. First pitch on its way. And there it goes. He got all of this one. And that one is. Well, if you'd have told him when he woke up this morning that he was going to hit three home runs, I thought he was dreaming. On paper, this had the makings of a real hard fought game, but. Uh, Paper and reality, those are two different things. They pulled away and never looked back. And we're going to play one this next game. Well, I guess this is a four-game series, eh? In this ball game. Detroit put a 10 spot on the scoreboard in this one. Eight runners on base. Eight. 
afternoon baseball here on the show. Ryan Barucki is ready to go as he'll be on the mound for Toronto. All right, Ryan Barucki has a sinker, change, and a slider, and a curveball. No heaters. Top of the first, no on, no out. Minimizes the amount of walks. Keeps his hits down, and if he can do more of the same of that, he should have some pretty good fortune in this one here today. And quickly, there's one down to lead off the frame. So, top of the third, one on, no out, tied game, nothing, nothing. From the stretch, here's the pitch. Rounded to third, this could be two. There's one. On to first, and they turn the double play. Top of the fifth. So the lineup flips over. One on, two outs. We're trailing two runs. He's set. Here it comes. Hit hard back up the middle. And that's through for his first base hit in this one. Dan, after that base hit right there, we're talking about two full weeks of finding a way to be productive and get a knock. Good to think about that. You think how hard it is to get a base hit in a, in a professional baseball game and for him to be able to do it 14 consecutive days in a row. As a pitcher, you have to just tip your cap to this guy. Brantley is under it. He makes the play, and that'll end the inning. So back to the top of the Detroit lineup. Top of the seventh. No on, no out. Down four runs. Ryan Barucki is still in the on the mound. Well, when you've only surrendered one hit to the top three guys in the order up to this point in the game, you know you're doing something right, Matt. You're spot on. Whatever they discuss coming into this game has worked out beautifully. And the throw to first is in time, so Top of the ninth, two out, nobody on, down five runs. And he needs to make something happen. They're down to their final out here in the ninth. There's a swing, and he sends a ball high in the air into left field. And he'll get under it to make the catch, and the Blue Jays bounce back here to take the finale and earn a split of this four-game series as this one is over. So we take the series two games to, to win some two games out of the four. So we take two out of the four. To win at home in front of their home crowd. Six to one, <clears> the <throat> final tally today. The Blue Jays led. The All right, guys. Thanks for tuning in. Thanks for watching. If you like these videos, make sure you click the notification bell so you can be made aware when videos are uploaded to the channel. Click that subscribe button and like the video. Also, one big important thing leave your comments in the comment box below. Let me know your thoughts and opinions on the games that I played today. Also, guys, remember, I cannot stress this enough. Plant the seed today for a better tomorrow. With that being said, thank you for being too, elite, all, too sweet, all elite. And I will catch you guys in the next video.